Hello everyone, today we will discuss on important current affairs of 24th January. You can download PDF from the link given in the description of this video. If you are new to this channel, please subscribe and don't forget to press the bell icon. Let's start. First question. What is India's rank in EIU Democracy Index? Answer is 51st rank. India dropped 10 places and ranked at 51 in EIU Democracy Index. Which country is in the top of this index? Norway. Norway is in the top position in this index, followed by Iceland and Sweden in second and third rank. The EIU Democracy Index provides ranking for the state of democracy worldwide in 165 independent states and two union territories. The index measures score under five subcategories electoral process and pluralism, functioning of government, political participation, political culture, and civil liberties. Next question. When is Netaji Subhash Chandra Bose's birth anniversary celebrated? Right answer is 23rd January. He was born on 23rd January 1897 in Kathak, Odisha. Subhash Chandra Bose instilled patriotism among people and gave the slogan Jai Hind and inspired thousands of people to take part in freedom struggle. Subhash Chandra Bose remains one of the most beloved national heroes and an icon of India's freedom struggle. Next question. The wildlife census started from Mundathurai Tiger Reserve. Where is the Tiger Reserve located? Answer is Tamil Nadu. The annual wildlife census has started in Kalakkadu Mundathurai Tiger Sanctuary in Tamil Nadu. The survey will be conducted till 27th of January. The first part of the survey will be devoted to taking count of carnivores like tiger, jackals, etc. While the second phase will involve the enumeration of herbivores like elephants, deer and other animals. More than 300 persons including Forest officials, wildlife experts and college students are involved in this. The census findings will be included in the annual state of wildlife population report on the Union Ministry of Forest and Environment. Next question. What is India's rank in Global Talent Competitiveness Index 2020? Answer is 72nd rank. India moved 8 places up and ranked 72 in Global Talent Competitiveness Index 2020. This index is based on the ability of a nation to grow, attract and retain the talent. Switzerland is in the top position in this index, followed by US and Singapore. Next question. Manmohan Sud passed away at the age of 80. He belongs to which profession? The right answer is cricket. Manmohan Sud was a former test batsman and national selector. He played one test match and 39 first class matches with one century. He made his first class debut in 1957 and his last Ranji Trophy match was in 1964. Next question. Which city in India is the most polluted city as per the Greenpeace report released recently? Right answer is Jaria. Where is Jaria located? It is in Jharkhand. As per the report released by Greenpeace, Jharkhand's Jaria is the most polluted city in India. Second most polluted city is also in Jharkhand, it is in Dhanbad. And six of the top ten most polluted cities are in Uttar Pradesh as per this report. Jharkhand's area is most famous for its rich coal resources used to make coal. Jharia plays a very important role in the economy and development of Dhanbad city and is consider considered as part of Dhanbad city. Next question. Who has been conferred with Cisco Youth Leadership Award 2019? Right answer is Priya Prakash. Priya Prakash, the founder and CEO of India-based Health Set Go, has won the Global Citizen Prize Cisco Youth Leadership Award for 2019 for her school health program that aims at providing 360-degree healthcare support to children. The prestigious award honors an individual aged between 18 to 30 years. The award includes a US dollar 250000 price paid to the individual's organization to which the individual contributes to further their mission on accelerating glo global problem solving. HealthSetGo is a company that uses digital technology to make data-driven decisions to improve the health and lives of children. The company creates a digital health report card with the help of artificial intelligence and data analytics that provides complete information about the child's health age between 2 years to 17 years, which helps in finding the diseases or other issues they might have. Next question. 
rupee cooperative bank is said to be merged with which of the following bank correct answer is maharashtra state cooperative bank rupee cooperative bank is said to merge with maharashtra state cooperative bank rupee bank is 107 years old bank based in pune both the banks have submitted the merger proposal with rbi and waiting for the approval from rbi rupee cooperative bank currently has 35 branches and 304 employees and the bank's accumulated losses are rupees 650.89 crore crore until december 31st 2019 as a result they are going to going for a merger next question how many children are conferred with pradhan mantri rashtriya bal puraskar 2020 correct answer is 49 children pradhan mantri rashtriya bal puraskar 2020 was given to 49 children in the age of 5 to 18 years under various categories including innovation scholastic sports art and culture social service and bravery under this award the awardees were given a medal a cash prize of rupees 1 lakh a certificate and a citation who presented these awards president ramnath kovin presented these awards at rashtrapati bhavan ishan sharma who saved a russian tourist from two robbers omkar singh who holds the world record for the youngest theoretical author and youngest pianist in india gauri mishra were among those who, who were given this award next question government announced one nation one ration card scheme to be implemented from which date answer is 1st june one nation one ration card scheme will be implemented from 1st june in the whole country under this scheme a beneficiary will be able to avail benefits across the country using the same ration card this facility has been started in 12 states in the country on the first day of the new year under this facility the beneficiaries of the public distribution of the states can get their share of ration in any of the 12 states in which they are residing who is the minister of consumer affairs food and public distribution ram vilas paswan these are the important current affairs of 24th january please hit a like if the content is helpful thank you